bad boys. Hold on. I'm gonna do a light little re review. I'm on my way to the shop to get some food. I'm gonna do a light review. Oh, they gave me the blue one. Oh, this shit is fire, boy. This shit is fire. See this shit? amazing they quiet definitely quiet these these are like my game my protégés but just the blade is different i want to see how this blade is so yeah these are interchangeable um covers i could put on the, the pink i could put on the black but this blue right here is fire though this blue is crazy i'm not even gonna lie Definitely hella lightweight. Let me see what else it comes with. It's hella lightweight. Got the chargers, the guards, got some oil, some oil brush. That looks like a. I don't know what, oh, some extra levers, word. And a stretch bracket. That's fire. So for the stretch bracket, y'all, I think it opens to like up to like a, a, a full one. I don't really know exactly how it works, but that's what I think the stretch bracket is used for. So y'all, I'm about to head to the shop and show y'all what it do, man. Show y'all how these really work. Let's get it. YouTube, YouTube, you guys see the crisp lines. That's key. You got to make sure them lines is crisp. So, yeah, yeah, I see those rebels in my hand. Boy, them things is clean. So smooth. I love them. I love them. I'm not even going to lie. So, I'm going up about a half an inch. I got the clipper all the way open. All the way open. I'm going up about a half an inch and making sure that I'm just letting the clipper do what it do. I'm not forcing it. I'm not... I'm not doing nothing too crazy. I'm just letting the clipper do what it do. And guys, as you can see, I'm using the corner of the blade. It may look like I'm using the whole blade, but I'm really not. If I were to use the whole blade, I would probably not even have a circular shape in that in that area it will probably look kind of jacked up so you really just want to use the corners corner work so now guys i'm I'm here trying to get that bottom line out, right? And I got the clipper all the way closed, and I'm, I'm just moving the lever up and down. I'm seeing what works and seeing what doesn't. And even with the clipper all the way closed, with the lever all the way up, 
it was kind of difficult for me to get that line out because my clipper wasn't zero. The clipper isn't zero guy. And I like my clipper zero guy. It just makes, makes it easy. Maybe if I were to use like my trimmers, I would have got that bottom line out better. But I, I wanted to um try it with the Rebels. I'm going to definitely zero gap them. They definitely going to take that line out way, way quicker. Yup, you know I had to back out the protégés because I'm sorry, but the Rebels just wasn't, they just wasn't getting that line out. I'm sorry, they just wasn't. They look good, but uh, they wasn't doing that job, though. You know, my protégés is zero gap, so they're going to definitely get that line out a lot easier and a lot quicker, so had to. So guys, with the shaver, I'm not going up all the way to that line. It may look like I am, but I'm leaving a little tiny bit. Because if you go up all the way to the line where you make it bald and then straight to that line, it's going to be very difficult to take that line out. And hair like his, his hair is, is, is kind of hard to do. It's not really, I wouldn't say it's hard. I would say, but when you do get it good, it, it comes out flawless comes out flawless but his hair is a little bit tougher than than usual yo guys so you guys see that that bottom line is out i knocked him out it's gone so now i'm coming with the one guard and i'm going up about an inch and i have the lever all the way open with the lever all the way down that's what the lever open means for those who don't know lever open means the lever is all the way down lever close is lever all the way up Yo, it's not until after I realized that I'm using the protégés. Yo, I'm telling you, the Rebels and the protégés literally feel the same. I didn't even realize, like, I was using the protégés until I had to change my guards. And I'm like, wait, wait why am I using these? <laughs> Shit's crazy. Yo, so you guys see, I got the half guard, and I'm just using my corner. I got the I got the lever all the way down, all the way open, and I'm just I'm just corner work, corner work. I'm just flicking that line out. I'm flicking that line out in between the one and the lever all the way open. But Chato, you guys see that blue? Flawless, flawless. I'm not gonna lie, yo, Gamma, y'all did y'all thing. You can't cut. Now I'm about to go up about a half an inch with the number two guard all the way open. Now I'm just doing the same exact thing I did with the number two guard with the three guard. So now guys the fade is basically done but now I'm just polishing it with the um one and a half. I'm just coming back with the one and a half, the lever all the way up, all the way closed. I'm just flicking that line. Are you gonna see me later come with the one guard? And I'm gonna just use my corners and try to get that out. Thank you. 
So now I'm going to use my shears. I'm using my thinning shears and I'm going to just thin out that hair and make it blend nicely into that, that three. And to use your thinning shears, you you're supposed to really use thinning shears on hair like this. To use it and you get it right, it's going to flow so flawlessly into the blend. So I'm just going to let the video play now and I'm just repeating the same exact steps I did on the other side. So just enjoy the video and pay attention.
I'm back at the crib. It was a great day at the shop. I got some good cuts in with the Rebels. And yo, true say, I love them. And then when I get to the shop tomorrow, I'm going to definitely set them zero gut. But yeah, great cut, good video. And I'm going to catch y'all soon. Go check out my couple's channel with me and Jalen. It's going to be in the bio. And just run it up, y'all. Run it up. Let's run it up. Subscribe, share, and comment. Love y'all. We out.